Over here I got the Kingston Data Traveler Exodia Onyx. It's a 128 gigabyte USB 3.2 uh, flash drive. Uh, also known as a pen drive, whatever. Uh, I bought this mainly to use this uh, for uh, a rescue disc indoors, so I won't have to uh, get the one on my keychain. I just wanted to have uh, access to uh, miscellaneous tasks without uh, some tasks takes uh, takes longer to complete. So uh, if I have to leave the house, I won't have to uh, leave the keys inside my computer. So uh, this will stay in. And uh, yeah, so. Uh, as you can see, it's just a USB flash drive. That's what you get with it. You can see it right away. So I'm gonna open this up and uh, we'll plug it in and see how it goes. So there it is. It basically look. Uh, it looks nice. I like the design. And uh, right now it's uh, in a closed position. If you want to open it up, you just pull it back, and there you go. It's ready to be plugged in. Right now it's gonna be unpartitioned. It's good because I need to install the rescue disk system. I'm gonna put like a Ventoid. Ventoid is a system that you can install multiple ISOs on. So I could use that to put uh, like uh, the Windows image, uh, Windows 10, Windows 11, like uh, Linux systems and uh, some uh, rescue disks. To put some rescue discs on it if I need to uh, do various tasks on it so it's good so uh, basically that's what I'll do right now but I just wanted to take a closer look on the drive itself you have a USB 3.2 over there uh, but yeah I'm pretty excited to start using that that way it's a good solution for me not to use that keychain that I, that I have the keychain I'll use it when I go out and everything but this will be indoors so uh, basically this uh, this this has been the video about the Kingston Exodia Data Traveler 3.2 USB flash drive I hope you enjoyed it if you like uh, these kind of videos make sure you stay tuned there are more coming coming in uh, yeah subscribe if you want to and uh, yeah, sure. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.